like? God, let's go. I haven't filmed in ages. We done? Arms down, up. Ugh. Right, okay. Let's just get back in. Hello and assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I haven't filmed in so, so long. Um, sorry about that, but I'm just gonna get cracking. I thought I would do a bit of a haul video. Now, these are just like random bits and bobs. I've got some homework, I've got some fashion, um, and I've got some plant stuff, which you can see right behind me. And I absolutely love it. This is my first big house plant. I've got a couple of little ones. So I thought I would start off with fashion items and end with Lush products because I know my fingers are gonna get a little bit sticky from them. So the first place I went to is TK Maxx. The first thing I got were these jeans and this is from Paper and Stitch. I've never heard of them, um, but this was only 14 99 so I thought that's such a good price for um, a nice pair of black jeans. If you see me looking over there, I'm just looking at the um, TV screen to make sure that I'm actually in focus and you can see it. Just some um, normal black skinny jeans there. Oh my god, that gives me a heart attack every single blinking time. Right, anyway, there's something about the stitching or the shaping or the cut that makes your bum look quite nice. So these are my first pair. And I have put on weight, so this is the first pair of jeans that I brought with this size. I'm not going to say what size I am, but you know, being at home on maternity leave has made me put on a little bit of weight. I say a little bit, I mean like this is the heaviest I've ever been. <laughs> the next thing I've got were these green treat socks and these are just your standard trainer socks. They were reduced to £2 each um, so I actually got two packs of these because I quite like trainer socks and um, especially in the spring and summer it would be nice to wear with my converse and show a bit of ankle cleavage. The last thing I got from TK Maxx was this really long um, maxi dress and I absolutely love it. It's going to be perfect for spring and summer. Um, and this is from the brand Myra and Co. Myra and Co. I'm not sure. And this was only 19.99. And I absolutely love it. It looks so nice on as well. Got your three quarter length sleeves. I think you can unbutton it, but I quite like the button effect. And the thing I like about this is you don't actually have to wear like a vest underneath. It does have a couple of slits at the front, but generally I wear leggings with my dresses. So um, yeah, I love floral things, especially at this time of the year. And then we went to H&M, bought this really nice thick jumper. I actually got it in a large because I wanted it to be a bit oversized on me. Um, and I really like the sleeves. They're like bubblish sleeves. Like, and I really like the colours. You can see I'm wearing a grey jumper today as well. But I thought it'd be really nice just to chuck on with some jeans um, or some trousers. And this was only £9 as well. <laughs> this set of three hexagon hoops. I absolutely love hexagons. I've got like hexagon coasters. I've got um, the last thing that I crocheted was a hexagon blanket. So I really like it. Just set of three. It'll be nice to wear like when I do like a turban style, if I'm wearing a hijab and I'm going out or if I'm just indoors. Really nice. I think it's quite nice to have like different sizes as well. I probably get the most wear out of the middle size, but really like them. And these were only 5 at 99 so I've only got one baby related item, so I might as well mention that. And I brought this from Babo Me. I will leave links in the down bar if I can get them online. Um, and it's this. It's the Lil Baby Baby Carrier. And I've wanted a baby carrier for ages. Um, but there's so many out there. Like, it's so hard to actually decide what you want to get. Um, I was looking into the Ergo Baby 360 Carrier, but it was so expensive. And I couldn't see one on sale. And then when I saw this for £65, I was like, do you know what? I'm just going to get it. If I was to sell it off after all my babies, then, you know, I'd still make a decent amount on it. Got really good lumbar support as well. So if you have back problems, it's good for that. The only thing that I've noticed with this, it's quite a bulky sling. Um, so, you know, it's not very travel efficient. Like if you're taking a pram and then you've got this in your bag, you know, it's not going to fit in your bag. Um, whereas my friend, I think she takes her carrier. I don't know what she's got. I think it starts with a C. I'm not 100% sure. But her carrier, she says that she just carries it around like in her bag and whenever she needs it, she can take it out. So there is that to consider. It's really easy putting this on and taking it off. Um, and my baby seems to like it. We went on a really nice long walk 
couple of weeks ago, or was it last week? Yeah, I don't go on walks that much. I'd love to, but as soon as the weather like gets sunny again, I will definitely go out. Like I went out with him a really nice long walk in at this, and it was really sunny. So when the sun's out, you know, I'm out. <laughs> Um, I am thinking of doing a good review, like an in-depth review on this, but I'll only do it once, like, I've worn it quite a lot. Moving on to homeware, and the thing that has given me, like, a tiny heart attack every single time it goes off is this. It's the Glade something. I don't actually know what it's called. I think there's three options. My husband said it, so I don't know. But this one goes off every 36 minutes, I think. And, oh my gosh, when you're just sat there in the toilet, just, you know... I'm on my phone a lot of the time when I'm on the toilet. This is in the evening when my baby's in bed. And this has gone off and oh, it's horrible. It makes the, it makes the toilet smell really nice. Um, so it's just this thing. We got it from Wilkinson actually for about five pounds. And we also got a refill and these are two pounds at the moment and they're originally four pounds. Um, I think the one that's in there is the peony and cherry scent or cherry and something scents. Quite a nice fruity floral scent and then we've got hawaii and breeze as a refill for when that runs out the, the only thing about that is you can't switch it off because i think for that to go off every 36 minutes throughout the day it's not going to last very long there isn't like an on and off button which i wish there was but it makes the toilet smell really nice so i can't complain there are a few other bits and bobs that i bought for the house but i didn't think they were that exciting so i'm not going to show them in this video otherwise i think the video is going to be way too long as well um but then the next stop was ikea a dish strainer which i'll try and do an insert but i really like it so far it's held up really well and it was only six pounds the next thing are these glasses they were only 50 pence each and i think they hold about 300 and something mil in them um it doesn't say on the bottom but they're really nice. My husband was like, the only colour that we need now is mustard. But they didn't have like a yellowy colour. I've already filled this. We've had this for a couple of days. It's, I've been, it's been washed. And it's this jar. I think it was a pound 50, a pound something. Definitely less than two pounds anyway. It's got ban mix. I never have ban. I don't like it that much. This and sweets is what you'll see him nibbling on. You'll see me nibbling on chocolate, biscuits, so much more. And then from Ikea, we brought this plant and I absolutely love it. Like, you don't understand how happy it makes me. Every time I see it, it's just, ah, oh, it makes me so happy. I love it. Um, and it was only £7.50. They water it really well and it's bloomed so beautifully. Um, and the pot that you can see in it, I would take it out, but it's a little bit heavy, um, is from HomeSense and it was only 14 99 Bearing in mind, when I've looked online, because I absolutely love it, I love the style, so when I've looked online, it's so expensive, and I think the one in HomeBase is like £40, not one four, four zero pounds So when I saw this for 14 99 I didn't even hesitate, I just put it straight into my trolley, because I absolutely love it. Honestly, if I was to see any more, I'd definitely pick them up. Um, for that price, absolute bargain. So I love HomeSense, honestly, I could buy so much in HomeSense, but I had to stop myself. And when my husband's shopping with me, I can't pick up like a lot of things. He kind of notices and, you know. These two things I got from Poundland for my like, plant stuff. I'm thinking of doing a video for like garden plants and whatever, but I haven't like organized anything. But these two I got from Poundland. And the last thing from Poundland I brought was this really pretty, um, little storage box in there. I've got pins in there, I've got um, nail clippers in there, I keep my tweezers in there, my thread in there. So there's quite a bit that fits into there. I think it's so pretty. Excuse my crusty nails, I wash my hands way too much. <laughs> I want to explain the next thing I brought because I look at it, really like it. I really, really like the bedding. It's very fun, it's very spring, it's summer, it's very in your face. <laughs> um, but I bought this when it was sunny. So again, we're talking last week. It was very sunny. It's this bedding and it's got pineapples over it. And it was only £14 for a king size. So, you know, I can't say no to that. Um, yeah, I really like it. It's very fun. Um, yeah, I like it anyway. You know, because all the bedding that we've got is um, very monochrome. It's very like greys, blacks, whites. So I saw some Muhala. I picked it up. <laughs> now this I actually brought when I was in Gloucester not the frame, the frame I brought ages ago and I just wanted to mention it because um, the girl that I brought this off is actually someone, someone I've known for absolutely years um, she's really lovely her artwork is absolutely amazing like her calligraphy, 
she does so much i think she makes um christmas baubles as well like personalized ones um, and she does shipping everywhere i think she's got an etsy account i'll leave all her links at the down bar her instagram definitely leave that in the down bar this is what i ordered from her it says the much of the favors of your lord will you deny and it's from surah rahman it's so so gorgeous absolutely love it and all hand painted or hand lettered honestly her work is incredible please check her out she's just so good i've also got some tissue this is what happens when you've got a kid <laughs> the first thing i bought was a polyamorous bath oil and it smells so nice all you do is just pop it in the bath and it turns into an oil so i'm not going to touch it because my fingers will go really greasy um it looks like this and it smells so good it smells like um what are those sweets those love heart sweets yeah they smell like that it's so nice um i'm hoping to put about half of this in one bath and give half to my husband as well the next thing i brought was a green coconut jelly balm i think it smells really lovely it smells very like tropical it smells really good and i think when you um when you put it in the bath it turns into like a jelly sort of thing it smells so nice there's one thing I love about Lush products, they just smell so good. You put it in a room and you keep it there for a couple of hours, the whole room just smells so good. I love Lush. And the last thing I bought from Lush was the Twilight Bath Bubble. Just give me something that's going to make me relax, something that's going to smell really pretty. Yeah, it smells so good, honestly. Oh, I could have a bath right now, it smells amazing. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to use these soon. That's a lot of the things that I've brought recently. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will catch you next time. Bye.